Hi, today's iClicker tip is using the Master Clicker and PowerPoints presentation mode, otherwise known as the extended desktop view. So go ahead and open a PowerPoint, and you'll see that it is hooked to this screen that is very similar to what you would see in a classroom. I've gone to the Slideshow tab and clicked Presenter View. So now, when I begin my slideshow, you'll see your current screen, the next screen coming up, and your notes pane is on your local computer, but actually displayed to the students is only the slideshow view. I started iClicker earlier, but you could start it any time along the way. I'm going to take the polling bar and move it out to my extended desktop so that the students can see the poll in progress. I've registered my master clicker in the iClicker program to work um, to control the iClicker poll. So I'm going to go to my next slide and ask my first qu question. Where do I add my master clicker ID number? A, the iClicker program settings and preferences, general tab. B, through the tool in my Sakai course. Or C, the iGrader program, synchronize button. After the polling has been done, I can stop the poll and click B to show the chart. You'll see that by default it shows on my local machine, but I want to drag it out to the extended view one time. iClicker will remember that placement, and after I drag it out, I can use my Show Correct Answer button, E, to mark the correct answer for this poll. So A is the correct answer. You set it in the iClicker program and now we can hide the poll. I'll press C to advance my PowerPoint onto the next question. Begin this poll by pressing A. Stop the poll show the chart, and of course, the answer here is all of the above. You can get help for all of your computing needs, not just iClicker, through our website, through the Clickers at UD Sakai project by emailing atsinfo at UDEL or calling us at 831-0640. I hope this little demonstration is helpful.